Alright everybody, we are at Collected 5. Right now we have Rai versus Magmios. Magmios rocking the 0-2 Samus, Rai being a Lucario play. We are going to start for Game 1 on Dreamland. We are currently in neutral, trying to fill each other out. You know what I'm saying? See the first expose one another. Magmios with the grab, up throw, then convert off anything, sort of still spacing out. Right with the down tilt. Almost got something started, but didn't quite continue. Nice down tilt, dash tag cancels. Let's go. Dead even game as both players are rocking 53%. I spoke too soon. Commentary's curse, let's go. <laughs> Magmio's trying to poke at him with that zero suit reach. Being on platforms is very dangerous against Zero Suit as she can just sit there and poke at you all day. Nice back there. The excellent spacing by both players. You know. Ooh, power shield point blank. Let's go. Neutral area is going to take that first stock from Rai. Rai with an early lead, but not too silly. Lucario's recovery will get back to the stage. Now, Rai right here wants to put on as much damage as he possibly can, maybe even take another stock while he's at that. Right now he's doing good. That back air not quite sealing the deal. Rai will get back. Ooh. Oh, a little premature on the force smash. Let it go a little too early. Or either that or Rai was a little bit too low. That back air will take that stock. Magneo slipping at 45%. Even game. A stock is not a stock. Or a stock is not a lead in Smash Brothers as it can go very quickly as gimps are a thing. Missing the pivot grab. Rai not punishing. Nice down there is. Down air, down air, up air, up air, up air, let's go. Magneto stacking on a quick 104%. But Lucario being a combo combo fiend in this game. Just do not let him touch him. Uh, Magneto's unfortunately missing his edge guard attempt right there. All right, we'll get back to the stage. Both players are running back to neutral, filling each other out. Rai has to open up. Nice neutral air, not quite gonna kill. We have a dead even game. This is amazing. This is this is what it looks like when players around relatively the same skill level play. It just it's just a very intense game all the way through. Missing his double team cancel down smash, but he will get to stage. Magneto's opting not to edge go. But that force smash will take that stock off of Rai. Three stocks or two. Now, like I said earlier in the commentary, Magmios is not going to want to put on as much damage as he can before Rai takes the stock off of him. Nice grab. Unfortunately, didn't get anything off it. Nice power shield. Missing his punish. Now he will get double up to it. Nice neutral air that's going to take the stock. Dead even game, 37%. Not a huge deficit by any means. Missing the pivot grab. See, this. Oh. Rai, unfortunately, not getting his punish. There's a lot of whiffing going on. Hopefully, I don't I don't recall both of these players doing a button check, so that may be in part due to what's going on. Nice little combo by Rai there, second on a good 75%. But like I said earlier, we still have a dead even game. Won't get the down smash. Rai will recover to the stage. Misses Tuck Chase. Nice, nice double team down smash. It's not going to quite take the stock yet. But now it will. Commentary's curse. Ooh, quick 25 damage. That's very good for Rai in this position. Magneto's feeding for that back there. And he will get it. So we now have a dead even game once again. Playing footsies. Yeah, double team is an excellent move for getting through projectiles like that. But if you can read it, it's very uh, punishable. And Magnus will get. Both these players opting not to edge guard, like at least grab the ledge. They just want to hit somebody in the face, it looks. But I guess that is Smash Brothers. So we'll take it. Missing the grab off the tech roll. He had the read. That neutral area is going to take the game. Rai taking game one. Now for Magmios' counter pick, 
uh, as a Zero Suit Samus, I know he's definitely going to want to go somewhere with platforms on it, but I do know Magmios has other characters that he likes to play with. Uh, if he leaves Battlefield open, I will possibly say that's a mistake, and he did. So I could possibly see them going, or Magmios counterpicking to Battlefield. The reason why platforms don't necessarily work on Dream Lane is because they are higher than normal. Magmio's thinking quite hard about his counter pick. Looks like he wants to go to Yoshi's Island Brawl. Alright, well it looks like Yoshi's Island Brawl. Oh, Ryder gonna take three down areas. Right now, Magmio's starting out very strong, putting on a quick 73%. 87. The players, of course, trying to open each other up. Nice comp. Nice cancel by Ryan. Ooh, nice down smash. That should take the stock, guess. Great timing by Magnus. Now he takes the early lead, but this is how he started out for game one, but Ryan brought it back. Uh, so do not count Ryan out by any means. Nice. Nice dodging that Boris Sphere in midair. Showing great awareness of where he's at. That down smash will take the stock, even it up. Three stocks apiece. Three, four down airs. Let's go. Magmios looking like M. Bison. Spacing out that back air, and that's back air. I don't, I don't have a bracket. Craig. Okay, back to the commentary, folks. We are currently updating bracket. Nice for smash from Magmios. That's going to seal that stock. Three stocks is two. Magmios sitting at low percent. Uh, seems like he's feeling himself. Uh, spacing is a lot more on point. Doesn't seem like he's missing his punishes like he was last game. Nice jab reset. Ooh, got the roll read into the grab. Fortunately, he didn't actually convert too hard. Now it's going to be Rise counterattack, but it seems like Magnus reversed it once again. Nice combos by Magnus. He is doing an extremely good job this round, showing that he adapted very well. Oh, that's where you don't want to be against a zero suit. Nice back air. Not quite going to take the sock though. And Lucario can't cover that distance. Magnus. Nice back here, that's going to take the stock. Magmios up three stocks to one. Magmios is doing a very good job in adapting. Uh, sorry about that, folks. There's a strange noise in the background. Um, That's back here by Magnus. Magnus has Rai on the run right now. Rai cannot find his footing. Oh, going. This time, that's the first time I've seen Magnus off stage attempting an edge guard, except he didn't do anything. Unfortunately, but now both players are back in neutral, uh, dancing around one another, trying to find his final opening. Magnus fishing for the back airs. Ooh, almost SD right there. Magnus going to take game two. Three socks, two. None. Alright ladies and gentlemen, we are going to game three. So far this is an excellent set between both players. I think Magmio's banned Fountain of Dreams, Yoshi's Story, and Battlefield actually. I think maybe Rai may opt to go to Green Hill. Or something with small sides because Lucario's Nair kills very early. Or he may be character switching to Mark. Going to WarioWare? Yes, sir. Here we go. Alright. I have not seen Rai play Marth, so this is going to be new for me. Magmios with a very, very early stock right here. Uh, this is a very good 
advantage for Magnus. That means he now controls the pacing of the game. But right on the counter attack. This is one of Mark's good stages. I mean, you do not want to stay on that platform, especially with that tip. The force match can easily take it regardless of which side they're on. Nice. Nice shot. Into a neutral area, putting on 2%. Back air. Oh, pivot grab missed. Misses with punish, unfortunately. Nice spacing by Magnus. He is on point right now with that. Rai seems to be struggling getting this first stock on with Magnus. Throwing out four smashes now, as a Mark player, that's not something you really want to do because one, that shows a sign of desperation. And then a player like Magmios, that will, they will feed off of something like that. Unfortunately, Magmios messing up his recovery. Nice back air. That will take the stock as these sides on Warrior were extremely small. Nice tech chase into the force smash. Nice jump. He was about to get down to it. Uh, Rai had a combo going on right there, but he opted to end it early. But I guess that is a nice tip by, by Rai. Will it be up the game? Two stocks apiece. Low percents. Magmio's on the counter attack right now. Ooh. Putting on that pressure. Doing a bunch of cross ups. Not actually trying to fake out Magmio's. And uh, there we go. That's that WarioWare effect with Mark. Ooh, nice grab. Nice down air. Grab the ledge. Oh my goodness. You gotta grab the ledge, man. You can't. Mark coming in that low, it's easy to edge grab. But, of course, as a commentator, I, you know, I know what I see. And right now, Magmio's opting to let Marth come back to the stage two times in a row. And he is at death percent. This isn't very good. All Ryan needs is a forward smash at this point. Or even a forward tilt at a tip. But, one stock to piece, anything can happen. Zero to deaths are a thing. Oh, bad. Ryan going for the hard read right there. Unfortunately, he guessed wrong. But, a hard read is right as long as you know that they're going to do something where your attack would cover, but it's just a direction. Magmio's doing an excellent job. Nice, why? Magmio's on the ropes. Oh, that neutral is going to take the game. Riot will take it over Magnus three games to one, or two games to one. 